So the new vaccine that was just approved by the FDA is essentially a COVID vaccine, but it's targeting a different strain of the COVID vaccine than was in the original vaccine or in the bivalent vaccines that came out last year. So it's still a COVID vaccine, but it's now targeting the XBB strain, which has been the Omicron type virus that's been circulating throughout um, the U.S. and most parts of the world since the beginning of um, this year. It's not exactly a booster. I would uh, liken it to the influenza vaccine that comes out each year. They're all influenza vaccines, but the strains that they protect against change year from year. So the COVID vaccine definitely should be taken by those at highest risk of complications from COVID, and that includes older people, people with weakened immune systems, very young um, uh, children. These are the people that we are seeing have significant complications from COVID. So the vaccine is recommended for everyone who is six months and older. And the groups that benefit the most from the vaccine, again, are the same kind of people who benefit from the COVID vaccine, older individuals, people who have underlying immune deficiencies, people with underlying heart, lung, liver, kidney disease, uh, because they don't tolerate influenza as well as others.